So this is one of those knockoff uh, Super NES minis. But man, this game has a lot of weird games on it. And one game that I found on here was really disgusting. It's called Dick Kids. And man, it is pretty bad. Let's check it out. Let's do it. Welcome back to Gamer to Gamer. And I've been playing games and collecting games ever since I was a kid. So therefore I decided to start this channel up. So if you like my videos, smash that like button and subscribe. So without further ado, let's start the video. Welcome back to Gamer to Gamer. And a little warning here, the game that we're gonna play might be a little offensive. So uh, here we go. This is the Super Mini SN02. I got this a couple of years ago and it's a pretty fun system. But there's some games on here that are really questionable. Like one of them was Black Man 2. I made a video on that and you might want to check it out. But there's another game on here that is pretty bad and it's called Dick Kids. So uh, last warning, let's jump into this. All right, let's do it. Okay, there's nothing fancy about the menu here, and all these have different games up in it. So, Puzzle Game has some weird games in it. This is where I found Black Man. So, on number 75, that's where you find Dick Kids. Right there, number 75. Alright, so, uh, let's jump into this. Let's play some Dick Kids. Alright, so everything seems pretty normal here, and the music is kind of cool. Alright, so... Here's where things take a little turn right here. Once you hit the start button, all right here, let's hit it. And there you go, a little naked kid pops up. He has no clothes on. All right, let's start the game. Okay, so from here, you're in a tent. I guess you're having a little sleepover with your buddy. And let's take a look and see what they're reading. Yep, they're reading porn. <laughs> I could believe it, porn. Not to mention, both of the boys were butt naked. But let's see what they're reading in this porn book. Ronald was showing off his magic bag at a picnic in the meadow when all of a sudden... I don't know what happens out of that. But as you can see, Ronald's pee-pee is standing up. And oh my god, look at Ronald. He walked up. Oh my god, did you guys see that? Let's check that out again. Okay, dude's walking out with a hard on. His pee pee is clearly out. That is horrible. Just horrible. All right, so let's start the game. So in case you haven't noticed, let's rewind it. All the houses are penises. Yeah, penises. I could make it up even if I wanted to. All right, let's let's uh, let's start the game. And the game is pretty basic. Um, I'm horrible at these uh, kind of games. But yeah, look at him. He's, he's butt booty naked. Uh trying to jump on squirrels to get M. I guess he wants McDonald's. I don't know. And it's really glitchy, but uh, I can't believe... Why would the developers, uh, you know, do something like this? I guess they thought it was funny. This, this isn't funny. This is so not cool. So not cool. Uh, I don't know what that is. Some kind of flower. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so I'm just going to try to get to the end as fast as I can just to see what's next. Okay. All right, then, oh, there's the black little naked one now. All right. Okay, and we're back at the penis stage. This is so uncomfortable. What's the next one? All right. Okay, there's, okay. This is, this is pretty lame. <laughs> okay, we got some kind of squirrels there. All right, what am I doing here? Just, oh, okay, I guess that's the ending. Yeah, this is the ending. I, oh, there's a naked one again. <laughs> and the penis stage just kills me. All right, all right, I don't even want to know what's next. Oh, God, it's pretty much the same thing. It's, it's, it's pretty horrible. God, why did they make this guy naked? I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. I'm just going to get through here. Just run through. 
It's, it's not even entertaining. It's just okay. All right, I'm done. No more playing as a naked child. There's the black guy. There we go. There he is. Alright guys, I'm gonna call it quits here. I don't even want to know what's next, what's the main goal here, but hey, whenever you buy these kind of consoles from China, just beware, you never know what you're gonna get in these things. You know, a lot of these games are legit and they're really fun, but yeah, sometimes you have some crazy games uh on these things. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Gamer to gamer. Peace.